I've recently ordered the 5.5 inch MIPI display from AliExpress. It took a while to get here but it's working well and that's what matters the most. I've actually unpacked it before filming and applied the tape to prevent any damage. The display itself comes with small MIPI adapter and bigger HDMI port. I've glued the LCD cable to the back of it to prevent it from tearing. The cable places the MIPI board in awkward position but it can be held. The HDMI board is pretty small, it uses two types of USB ports for power. The HDMI board connects to the display via this big flat cable. I've connected the display to my PC and as you can see it works perfectly. The quality is really good and it's pretty responsive. I've designed this simple plastic bracket which will prevent the display from being damaged. It's a flat piece so it sprints really fast. I've designed it so it can be welded shut using soldering iron. Display should go inside the bracket without any pushback. If there's any force needed to put it inside, it means that it's too tight and the display will break. The top plate is meant to attach to the plastic pillars. The flat cable has to go into the gap on the top plate. This will make the cable management easier. Now I just gently push both plastic pieces so that they connect well. And now I can connect both pieces using the soldering iron. I squeeze both plastic pieces while using soldering iron so that they connect tightly. I'm pretty satisfied with how it looks so far, you could make some pretty cool stuff out of it. In its current state you could use it as some kind of portable display. I will use it for something completely different later on. I've made some adjustment to the 3D files so that HDMI board will be held in place on top of the lid. This is the new tab cover, it has built-in HDMI board holder. It requires you to print the bottom part once again since the plastic pillars are single use. The board holder uses plastic pillars as well, this will ensure that the board won't fall off. After removing display from plastic frame, both plastic parts can be thrown out. I've printed a brand new set of plastic parts, which will now be combined into one piece. As before, I will start by putting the display into the frame and then I will cover it with lid.
And now I can install the HDMI board on top of the plastic pillars. And here are the final results. You can of course further modify to better suit your needs. Thanks for watching. As always, huge thanks to all my patrons and people that follow my projects. More stuff is coming soon.